Last video, I spent 39 hours in the DLC and finally beat my first From Software DLC since this is my first Souls game. And frankly, I pretty much relied on everything I had in the base game, so I decided to start Elden Ring and the DLC. The rules are pretty simple. I have to stay in the Shadow Realm, and I have to beat the Shadow Realm. Now, I did add a tad bit of a twist to make this fun and enjoyable and not torturous, because I'm a normal human. So every time I get a Skidoo Fragment, I will also get a Flash Charge and a Sacred Tear. A, so we don't just spawn them in, and then B, because I don't want to go on four Flasks. And when I collect Revered Spirit Ashes, I can either use them, or I can trade them in to get something from the base game. But this is limited to Bell Bearings, Talismans, Talisman Pouches, Cookbooks, and Physic Tears. So pretty much just buffs. Anyways, if you like content like this, feel free to subscribe and come around more often. I'd love to have you. But let's go ahead and hop into the Shadow Realm. All right, today is a fun day. Um, we are going to be starting our own um, version of the uh, Stranded playthrough. So a lot of big YouTubers and, you know, Souls people have been doing the Stranded playthrough where they start in the DLC. All right. And that's cool. But um, I want to do it and I actually want to enjoy the DLC. So the point of this is for me to explore the entire DLC, not to hate my life. So point is to have a good time. So there's a few rules that we've changed. So every time that we level up a scoot, scat, skidoo tree level, we get to increase the amount of flash that we have by one. And we also get to increase the uh, like sacred tier status of it by one and revered spirit ashes. We can trade those in for four items from the base game. Now, the items that we're restricted to, we're not doing like armor and stuff like that. Um, it's pretty much so we have limited ourselves to talismans, physic tiers, cookbooks and bell bearings. And that is it uh, for a couple of reasons. A, I want to be finding these fragments and everything and it'd be fun because I'm not going to use summons. It's just not me. And and I want to explore all the areas of the world or beard spirit ashes, blah, blah, blah. So came up with this. Frankly, I'm not sure how other people are starting in the DLC because using cheat engine and the art tool, I didn't find that option, which kind of makes sense if you don't already, you know, own the DLC. So the way that I've been doing it is teleporting to Altus, killing Radon, killing Moog, hopping into the DLC, then memory of gracing to lose all the runes. And then after that, we can actually start the run. Hunting time. All right. Okay, so right off the bat, we can get a revered spirit ash and two skidoo fragments pretty much. Um, just like right up here. So let's go. Let's go here first. Now the challenge with this, if we get hit by anything. We even get br like, like breathed on. What is the blown on? No, 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 not blown. What? What is the proper like? I was breathed on. That doesn't sound right. There's our first Skidoo tree fragment. So we should be able to uh, plus one, I think. Yep. Okay. Sacred. Sacred tier. Golden seed. Okay. And that should give us. Exactly. Beautiful. Um, flasks don't really matter at this point in time because we're going to die to everything. Church of Consolation is our next point. I know we could get, um, we could get the Great Katana. We can almost build that. There's also the Backhand Blades, which we can get, uh, I think without killing anything. All right, do we just say screw it? Okay, there's the two Skidoo Fragments. There's also supposed to be a Revered Spirit Ash over here somewhere. Uh, is that it? It's a legendary item. Blessing America. Great. Like, honestly, even being able to kill these dogs would be just a win right now. Perfect. Okay, so there's our first revered spirit ash. That is very helpful. Um, we're going to go try and get the great katana. Oh, broken rune. That helps. I never thought I'd say that. Okay, we have our first thing of armor, which this armor does a 10% on jump attacks. Learned that recently. Uh, I think this is actually the first cave that we went into, like, what grabs us grace? Better, uh, oh no, we never went in here. Um, well, I guess let's put on the Gravebird armor. That looks like something. Okay, um, 
great katana is somewhere over there so we won't be able to use it yeah so we're missing eight decks and well strength we can just two hands so that's fine all right um somehow the dragon did not wake up okay um this place is kind of funky i didn't come up here last time outer god heirloom i think that's the arcane yeah okay uh don't really care we didn't go over there let's, uh, let, let's check this out fully because this, this seems to be a pretty big plane up here yep okay nice that is a big win because now we can get the somber one two three and four bell bearing or not somber um well i mean we could do somber but it's not what i meant to say yeah, I can't really say I care about that too much. There is, on the other hand, a church, though. And there's a bear. I am not prepared to fight bear, so... Blue do talisman. That's not what I thought that was going to be. Okay, so we got uh, Pata. Okay, so we have another weapon and we have full armor, which... We probably can't use because it's going to be heavy load, probably. Across the bridge, I guess. I think there's a rune on this bridge, too. So that'll give us a spirit ash. That'll give us a rune. Oh, that wasn't it. Where? Where? Is it this one? 7,500 runes. Yep. Okay. Skidoo fragment. Uh, I think there's another one up there can we skidoo level no okay okay uh so we want to go over uh this way mm, what is this okay that's good i think might be able to have all the bell bearings now uh, all the smithing bell bearings uh seventeen thousand in the bank we had some threes and some fours. I think we're gonna have to commit to the great katana. I don't know, let's try it on a dog. Oh, that's a dead dog, okay. There's supposed to be like a, a sword over here. I don't know if it's gonna be any good. I know that bird's not any good. What is this? A somber four, cool. Like that. I feel like we're getting close to getting hit because I feel the lag. Oh, this is a Sterling Toast, nice. Nice, this is huge, I think. It's at least not small. A little bit better now. Okay, maybe not that one. Uh, I think there's supposed to be a dragon that comes down there, so I will pass on that one. This is pretty. This might be the prettiest area in the game. I don't want to die again. Are those guys going to get mad? They're going to get mad. Plus, this is definitely not going to be a room farming spot, so... Yes, Gadoo Tree. Perfect. All right, so that should level us up one more, I think. Yes. Skidoo Empowered. Okay, add Flask. So now we have a little bit more damage resistance. I do remember this guy throwing stuff at me. This, this is what takes us underground, so we don't... We won't need this for a while, I don't think. Uh, what has to be unlocked? I do it. Wait, yeah, what has to be unlocked here? Uh, because this is the sleeping dude, right? Obscured by Mikola. Do you have to kill? That's interesting. If you have to kill her before. Okay, let's go get the sword real quick. All right, these guys are mad. They are mad worms. Angry worms. Okay, this looks good. That's it. That's the sword. Okay, cool. That map's a little off, but that's okay. Let's see what it's like trying to kill like one of these these guys over here this is like a, a basic enemy nice nice how much money do you give come on be a lot oh it's just a thousand never mind for a reason, I thought it was like 4,000. All right, let's see. There should be that uh, guy holding something above his head. Oh, no, it's up here, isn't it? All right, uh, time to make a decision. I think I think we take Vig since we don't know what we want to level up. I think that's definitely the safest bet. If we want to go through here. I know there's a way to get around it with, without fighting Relena, but... Mm, 
Let me go up here to the left. I oh, guess another skidoo fragment. Ah, yes. Another skidoo. All right. So flask. So we're up to a good amount of flask, actually. Uh, what do you have? Okay, so we have a decent amount of runes. I mean, I think we use it all on Vig and puts at 28. Or when do we start doing endurance so that we can actually wear armor? Do that and then like eight endurance. Okay, so we can wear this whole thing. Okay, really kind of suddenly. We don't have a healthy FP bar, but we have one. So that's a positive. And then going to this castle, we don't really need to go in here for a while. Because we're not going to be able to kill anything. Yeah, I'd, we don't need to go in here. Okay, Shadow Realm runes. I mean, we've we've picked up actually a decent amount of rune drops. It's just not enough. And I mean, at some point we'll we'll start picking up enemies and that's when we'll really get going and everything will be fine. But until then, man, not looking great. Just gonna do Altus, baby. Fort of Reprimand, huge, 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 huge. That looks like bad news bears. All right, so now we just gotta figure out how to get through this area. Oh, that's a gigantic armor killer. What's this? This looks so tempting though. Oh no, no, I'm not dealing with that. That is death. Nice. I think we have officially made it to like Shadow Altus. Shadow Altus, not like fake Shadow Altus. Oh, I know where this is. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh no, 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 no. Don't look at me. I'm not doing anything. <sighs> yeah, the backhand blades are somewhere around here. There's a skidoo fragment. Perfect. I think I beat this with like skidoo level 12. So, uh, not quite. We have one level. Do we want to? I don't know where the backhand blades are. <sighs> the only problem is I don't do a good build up on poise. And in order to make them really good, we'll have to uh, spend a revered spirit ash to get them either a cold attunement or a better bleed. Uh, these guys typically drop those fragments. Ugh. Ugh. All right, hurry up. Pick it up, 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 pick it up. Uh, yes. I don't think it's in the hole, is it? No, I don't think it's in the hole. Okay, this looks like a fragment. I'll take that. Shadow Realm. Nice. Uh, this is never good. Heal from afar. Nice. We definitely don't need to be here. Do we want to be here? Dude, those birds are protecting something. Nice. Okay. Um, now we have the backhand blade. So is it time to make a, a semi-commitment to a weapon? I'm thinking maybe. I just don't know what weapon we should be committing to. Great Katana. Well, poise isn't a huge deal in this DLC because everything has a million and seven poise. Okay, so there, there's two free um, Skidoo fragments. Let's, let's do that and mold this over. We're not going to... Oh, we can't. Oh, but it doesn't do blood buildup, really? I mean, it's the cooler of the weapons. Plus, I did I did use the katana. But well, we might have to bring it back out. But without status effects, this is not going to be very good. Hmm. No, I actually don't feel like I've died all that much. I also haven't really tried to kill anything, so that would make a lot of sense. We're going to go ahead and level up a weapon because at... A plus 12, I feel like I can kill something. Or, I mean, plus 12, plus 18. I definitely can kill something at plus 18. Um, and by something, I mean something that would actually give us some runes. So I think that that's the play. Smithing stone, miners, bell bearing one, two, and three. And so that'll be three. And then we want the glintstone wet blade so then that is all of our all of these oh we I, I can't discard them didn't think that through uh i'll keep tracking a note I'll, I'll just do that i'll I'll just keep tracking a note nice okay 14 solid ashes of war wait a minute 
I have the web blade though. I have I have the I have the Western knife. Okay, they just don't care about that. Well, that's unfortunate. We will have to find a different Ash of War then. Oh, those sell for a lot, actually. Uh, I'll just go here for now. Um, so brain activity. Um, this guy, if we do a weird gesture at him, we can fight him. I don't know if we are ready for this, but but I do know if you kill him, you get his hat, which there we go. You get his hat, which is cool. Oh no, man. Oh. At least we're not one hit to him, which is nice. Oh, we're not ready for that. Okay, um, Rivermouth Cave. I mean, we could try and fight whatever's in here. Like, I think we have a solid weapon at this point in time. Let's let's go down the ruins. I don't know why that guy doesn't like get mad at me, but let's go down these ruins. Um, I'm thinking if we can get to the land of Ra or whatever, then we probably could do a little bit of rune farming. Shattered Stone Talisman. I don't think I ever cared about that. And I probably never will. Please don't hurt me. Pretty sure I'm one shot to everything. Uh, what's this? Shadowed Sunflower. I don't think anything's down here. So, yes, yes. And then this, this brings us to the place. And this is how you get to the back of, um, Shadow Keep to the church district, which if we're being honest, I don't know that that's all that helpful uh, at this point in time. Uh, do we just need health, which what Skadoo level are we? I don't think we're very high. Status, Skadoo Tree Blessing. Are we at level seven already? I mean, oh no, well, um, maybe at like 10. I think I beat the game with either 12 or 14. So maybe at like 10. We could, uh, we could start fighting some major bosses. Ow, jeez. Dude, see, look how beefy the dog is. We could try and kill the Moongrim guy. There's not really anything in for us, but we at least get the Skidoo Fragment and then whatever this message is. Okay, nice. So we're at eight. Four is probably pretty good. 15,000. Yeah, there we go. Okay, let's do that. We have a lot of the map unlocked. Maybe let's try our luck at this golem. We also could try our luck at Dancing Lion, but we're going to be so weak. Maybe we just go into Shadowkeep and uh, go to the Ruins of Ra. Because I don't, I don't know another way of us getting to a relatively reasonable level without doing some sort of rune farming, you know? So this rhino might be a problem. Let's uh, let's use uh, these and see how much runes. I mean, that'll be 30,000. 29, that's, that's better. But I was looking at our, um, if you look at our status, our damage resistance is actually pretty good. Like everything's in the 50s, so... I mean, I think we take that as a win. Let's let's do a litmus test on this. So it might be survivable. A heavy weapon would definitely be better, but. Nice block. Oh, okay. I wonder if we could kill the NPC at the very beginning with the Sword of Solitude. Or we could try Relena. At this point, our biggest struggle is surviving. So I first tried to get this deflecting hard tier the first of many times. I thought it was going to essentially be a cheat code, but after dying many times, I decided to go again on the rune hunt and kill this Yoda lookalike. Okay, Yoda. Oh, there is a Sega America. Okay. Oh, I'm just out of stamina. Oh, he parried me, bro. What? Oh, okay. Well, bro, bro, what was that? Oh, there's a double dodge there. Okay. Oh my gosh, dude is crazy. Dude is actually crazy. 
Nice. Okay. Waterfowl, really? We're gonna heal just because, like, we have no HP. Oh my gosh. Definitely interesting. I mean, I, I like this though. It's like, it's a new, it's a new experience. It's not the same old crap. Just, you know, rerun. I don't want to know what that does. It probably does something wild. Okay, we need to heal. Ow. Okay, buddy, you clearly did not hear me when I said I needed... Him falling on me hurt. Nice. I think once you learn that fight, I think it's probably really fun. Like straight up, I think it's probably pretty fun once you once you actually learn it. Uh, Eighty thousand. Not gonna lie, I wish it was more. Like by a lot. Okay. Uh, no, we are dumping everything. Thirty-eight. I think our goal is fifty. Um, I guess we can try this guy a couple times. I don't remember him being like too hard after you decided not to suck. He just, okay. The problem is, okay, no, nah, he, that's not happening. Where was that other guy that we fought? I think Hippo gives us a good amount. We might actually be able to kill Hippo now. He has so much health. Whoops. I, he just has too much health right now. Um, Still need runes. Uh, runes are my highest priority at the moment. Um, anything else that we could do? Want to take a sanity check at Rolana? Let me see if this opened. This what opened? Mhm. Mm it is what opened. Oh, bird came up here. Stop. Okay. That, yeah, that's not happening. Okay. We're not coming down here. That's not happening. We could do a couple other like side bosses. I mean, that's kind of the whole point of this. Ruined Forge Lava Intake. Um, let's do this one first. Rivermouth Cave. Okay. I hope I can get this. Dang it. Oh, it came down with me. Okay, cool. I was like that. Boss doors there. Why do I have a feeling that this does blood build up? All right. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. Okay. We got this. Woo! Okay. Oh, it's just one of the chief blood fiend. Oh, okay. He just does that a lot. Okay. Okay. So he's just kind of a spaz. Understood. Okay, so that's completely tracked. Seems like if you get hit by one there, you get hit by all of them. Okay, that's a really big smash. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay, that's bad. Okay, I'm stuck. I'm, I'm literally, what was I supposed to do there? <laughs> Chief Blood Fiend is definitely a dead man. I, did, I hope he gives some runes. Dude, I wish every DLC boss gave more runes, man. They just I don't feel like they give a lot so far. Come on. 
one, right? Bruh. Alright, last heal. How did... Oh my gosh, it's such trash. I primarily mean my gameplay. That was not good either. Pretty fine on that. I don't think you can go far enough. Bro, I hate this game so much. <laughs> Maybe if I wasn't using a plus 14 weapon, I would enjoy this. Bro. He's not even hitting me with that. Ow. Bro. There we go. Good lord. Okay, well we got a hexer. And ADK. Okay. I'm I'm not too terribly disappointed with that. We didn't make it through Bonnie Jail. We didn't look at this either. Dude, I'm I'm really not sure. I mean, I guess let's go in here. We can always litmus test the divine beast, see how rough it's gonna be. We do have two revered spirit ashes that we can spin now. I think the obvious one is the last smithing smithing bell bearing. Not sure what we should use our next one on. I don't remember what that was, but let me got. I think one or yeah, there's a couple. All right, come on. Ow! Please stop. Okay, now we've gotten both of them pissed off. Let's just go get the thing and leave. Bone bow. Yeah, that's not worth it. I'm just glad poison literally does nothing. Oh, here's another revered spirit ash. Uh, it's just one, but that's okay. I think this just goes straight to dancing line. Yep. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I really don't know what would be beneficial at the moment, if we're being honest. Uh, so we definitely got all the revered spirit ashes in here. Uh, let's litmus test dancing lion. We don't have, we, we literally don't have any physic tears though okay let's all right nothing in a flask because like, i just feel like the damage is just gonna be terrible oh man this music i miss the music oh uh, i saw somebody um jump over that one time Whoops. Okay, our damage negation isn't bad, though. Ow. I know that's a punish. I just don't know how yet. Okay, well, he's definitely beatable. It's just going to take a while. Because our damage is uh, not very good. Bro. Oh, okay. I thought it was far enough back. Yeah, this is gonna take a while, but like, I think I'm good enough at the fight. Just gotta not suck completely. A couple things you gotta learn here, though, so. Bro, I, I can't even see what he's doing. Mm. 
That was Harry. Okay. Perfect. It's the lightning, dude. It has nothing to do with him. It's just a stupid lightning. Can't even see anything. So cheesy, man. That's a fine punish, too. To be up. There we go. Okay. Divine Beast Dancing Lion down. That was probably way harder than it should have been, but damage wasn't great for a while. Um, all right. I think, yeah, I don't know what to do with these runes if we're just being 100% honest here. Uh, where's my head? Where's the head? Oh, there it is. I deserve that. I worked my butt off for that. I don't think that this goes anywhere important for a while, but I'll just double check. Whew. Okay, first remembrance boss down, which feels good. Uh, there might be a skidoo fragment up here actually so i'm not gonna knock that 150k what are we struggling with the most i mean we pro oh revered spirit ash that's that's good too at this point i think we're pretty close to being done oh we need five more vague endurance so we're gonna need a get amount more but the problem is if we only level up those things how are we ever gonna wield any better weapons in the backhand blades I don't know the answer to that. I'd like to give this a shot, but I need 21 int, 23 dex. It's not happening right now. Um, all right, I'm going to see if we can get this affecting tier for like the fifth time. All right, uh, five and then dump the rest in here. Yeah, I, I think I think if we have the deflecting tier, we have a good shot against Rolana. And that I think is probably our next priority is, is Rolana. That'll give us runes. Then again, what are we doing with the runes? An age old question. Okay, there's one. Bro, this is too early, like every single time. Probably gonna do that grab attack soon, so. At least we knock him down pretty quickly now. What? Dog, I don't understand. Okay, maybe we just so maybe we just try and run Rolana. Dude, I do want this uh this tier though. I'm just terrible at learning this, I guess. Too early, man. That's so annoying. Alright, let's let's try Rolana. Dude, I would love to get that tier, but it's it's not happening at the moment. Oh, okay. There was no being sneaky about that. Understood. I did. I, oh my gosh. I definitely do feel like uh, strength builds make Shadow of the Earth treat a whole lot easier. All right. Just go past the Moongrim lookalike. You know, I didn't see that there was a staircase down here. I wonder what using that hammer would be like. I mean, we probably have to have like 50 something strength, which we're not going to get. All right. Or Lana. All right, let's see how well I remember you. Probably not very well.
Okay, well, not good enough. hours <laughs> yeah she does not care about that see the problem is is like my attacks my attacks block me from seeing what she's doing Yeah, there's, the problem is, is her openings aren't big enough to do multiple attacks. So we're not getting much damage off each time. Cause like rolling R1s is like the only thing that's like safe. And that that's not good. Ah, uh, she's definitely beatable. Definitely beatable with our current skill level and our current equipment, so that is a positive. Bro, nice dodge. Oh my gosh. And we're getting relatively in the right area as far as health-wise goes. Just gotta be a tad bit better. Which, I mean, honestly, we could use the backstab to get out of, uh, what's it called, blind spot? We can do that to get out of some of the attacks. Dang it, dude. Definitely learning the fight a lot better this time. Okay. All right. So there is plenty to do without sitting here just brainlessly fighting this. Okay. Um, where's the stone sheathed sword? Where is that? Fog rift, catacombs, ruins of untire, ancient ruins of raw. I don't know. What do, what do we need most? I think we need between runes, skidoo tree stuff and spirit ashes so those are the three things that we need we didn't actually head down this area so i don't really remember this area very much if we're being templeton ruins i know there's a skidoo fragment somewhere but yeah i don't really remember down here all that much okay revered spirit ash that's good um not sure what all oh, that is but I definitely feel like this area is important. I just, I don't remember it at all. Oh, there's a hole. Genius. Skidoo fragment. Okay, nice. That's what we were really looking for, but we will go ahead and continue up here because why not? Really just want to see what was up here. Looks important. Uh, Gravebird black quill armor. Is that the one that does the jump attack bonus? I guess. The other one the other one definitely didn't the one thing with this dlc is i have such a love-hate relationship with how much verticality there is it's great as far as a gameplay point of view goes but it's kind of rough when you're trying to figure out what you're supposed to be doing and where you're supposed to be going when there's 80 million different different levels uh, would this be the black light catacomb scorpion river catacombs yeah no we never came down here might as well explore a little bit see if there's anything down here that's the one thing about like all of these dungeons have been ridiculous like it's definitely fun to have like different dungeons and them not being like the same old catacombs because the catacombs in the base game did get boring after a while because they're pretty much not all the same but like 
they were kind of all the same but like this this is more fun at least i think dude we got no heals okay we're just gonna die probably oh death knight He seems pretty similar to the other one, just different move. So probably get him with backstabs pretty easily, I guess. Oh, he's got a similar thing. Okay. Yeah, I'm not coming through this catacomb again. So we're we're gonna have to face tank this one. <laughs> this was this is a tough catacomb to get through. Oh, uh, that's a problem. Definitely got better though, right there. Nice. Didn't expect that. Whoops. He literally just went back to full house. Okay, well. Gosh, dude. I just suck, man. And like, I really don't want to be using the backhand blades anymore. I just don't. Like, they're not bad. They're not bad. Like, don't let this deceive you. It's just, I don't really like them all that much. Like for these type of bosses where there's not a ton of openings because like when you do have your very small opening okay i don't think the first one does any damage yeah dude you yeah, guys don't want to be using the backhand blades anymore, but like we don't have any other options because we don't have runes, we don't have stats. So like, what are our other options? There we go. Nice. Come on. Goodbye. Thank the Lord. Okay, I mean, dude, I, I don't even know really how to feel, like, because, how much runes did we get? 130,000, okay, that's positive. Like, I, I just don't know how to feel about, I can't tell if I'm just complete and other trash, or if this weapon isn't as good as, like, I would like it to be. You know what I mean? Like, I, is it is it not my style, or do I suck, or is it both? And I don't know the answer to that, and... Like we could go upgrade the great katana, but like, is that the answer? I don't really feel like it is. Uh, maybe we do switch to the great katana. 12 and 12. So the good thing is we'll have another plus 24 weapon. The bad news is we don't have any runes to upgrade. All right, um, let's try Rolanda now. See how that goes. Oh, man. Mm. 
I shouldn't have attacked there. I should have healed. I don't know why I attacked. I mean, habit, I guess. I gotta roll through on that now. Brain cells. Uh, man. I mean, we could go to the Fog Rift Catacombs. Dude, I don't even remember where they are. There, there's, there's a sword that's supposed to be good. Let's not sit here and just hate ourselves. Okay. Um, yeah, so there should be this sword that we can turn into the sort of lighter sort of darkness and probably do that just to see how it goes. Now I'm assuming it's going to be somber. So, so I don't, I don't actually know where this thing is. So we're just going to have to pretty much run around in here. Dude, I miss being overpowered to be honest. I wonder if there's something up there. We can try it out. This thing's fancy. Oh no. Black Knight commit. Why does anybody care? Okay, let's not do all this. Stop. Die. Die. Okay, I'm dead. Sting America though. We need more stamina, bro. That's what we need. Oh! They're slick. Wait, what? Hold on, that's not what I signed up for. These aren't connected, that throws me off. Oh, uh, here we go, okay. Now this, I think is what I signed up for. Stone cheese sword. Gotta have 18 strength. Okay. All right, so this is Spinny Boy. Been a while since I've spot Spinny Boy. I mean, we can kill Spinny Boy. He's not hard. Spinny Boy, not hard. And we got the Stone Sheath Sword, which means we can turn it into the Sword of Light or the Sword of Darkness. Which is better? I got no clue. I got, I got zero clue. And honestly, I'm not sure I really care either, so. Okay, nice. Appreciate that, brother. So you can't heal after the lightning spears. You, you can't. There's, there's not an opening there. Not an opening. Nice. Stamina. Take that. Nice. Okay. Death Knight dead. 110. Okay. Um. Yeah, at this point, I don't really know what to spend runes on. Let's go kill this guy down at this church. 
get his hammer see if we can understand the moveset and see how much strength it's gonna take to use That dude's super weak. Okay, nice. Okay, Black's still a great hammer. 25 strength, that's actually not that high. 17 fates is kind of high though. And then at the end of the day, it is a holy weapon. See, I just don't know where to put my runes, honestly. Uh, we haven't tried Hippo since we were a lot lower level. Think let's just, mm, I, I, we need more stam, but let's need strength. Yeah, let's just dump all of our levels into strength. All right, um, let's give Hippo a go. Our damage is a lot better, so. Yeah, I forgot about the porcupines. Okay, porcupines. Forgot about those stupid things. I think he gives like 200,000 too, so that'll be a good buff. And then that this will unlock the raw place, which is probably where the best rune farm is. I don't think I'm going to rune farm for levels, but I might rune farm to like upgrade weapons and stuff. <laughs> I, I, I cannot see what he was doing. Okay. I, did, I don't really remember Hippo's phase two all that well. That's an attack. <laughs> that was so far out. Are you joking? That's incredible. That is incredible, man. I gotta dodge into that one. Really? I dodged. I literally rolled, bro. What are we doing here, man? Bro, there's a gigantic... Bro, I forgot what that move was. Honestly, I, I had no idea what he was doing right there. That was an interesting experience. Bro. I don't think there's a way to perfectly dodge that, honestly. Bro, he should have staggered. Does his poise change in phase two? Like, he should have staggered. There, there was no reason he shouldn't have. Incredible. Incredible. What do, what? I don't, I don't understand how that attack works. Like he just opened his mouth and then I teleported into his mouth and died. Like that does not seem, it's fine, whatever. I still think killing him is our best next move though. So I'm out of stamina. Nice, okay. It's not gonna let me repost him anyway, so might as well. I didn't get hit there, but that was definitely luck. Okay. Ow. What are you supposed to do? There we go. Okay, at least he's dead. Dude, that was disgusting. Uh, I guess I could do tree fragment though. I'll take that. Okay, so we're maxed out at flash, which is nice. Okay, we have five revered spirit ashes that we haven't used yet. I'm keeping track of everything in like a word doc so that I don't accidentally use too many. Talisman pouches. So maybe that's what we start with. 
we do talisman pouches and then bell bearings. We're now down to zero. So somber one through four talisman one. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So we're caught up. I'm not sure what like build we're going to end up going with. I'm, I'm going to try the uh, probably night sword. I think it's called sword of night. Oh my gosh, that is such BS, man. Or sword of darkness. I think it is actually. Uh, and then we're going to go head up. So there's two revered spirit ashes in shadow keep. And then I think there's two to four in um, the Rao place. Uh, ruins of Rao or Rao ruins or something along those lines. All right. Uh, so if we go over to the left here, pretty much goes straight to the raw ruins. So I think we're going to do that. I think this is the right way. I, I actually really don't know. I, I think so though. It's it's been, been a minute since I came over here. What? There we go. There we go. Uh you're supposed to drop something, aren't you? A rain of fire, that's not what I thought you dropped. Red hood though? Red Riding Hood, baby. Uh, that drops us down to 50 points, though. Um, I still don't really remember my way around this place. I just know it's a pain. Okay, we're going to kill this pot guy. I don't know. If, I don't know. I, I saw on Fexter that some of them have Skidoo Fragments and stuff, so I'm killing all of them. Oh, he had a Revered Spirit Ash. That's golden. Another guy with the pot. Dude, I am killing all the dudes with pots. Ah, oh, just do Jim. Okay. You get a pot, too, though. Rar? Rar? I was under the impression that I'd be able to get down over here. Oh, I can. Okay, so there's two of these guys, and I think that they both drop revered spirit ashes. So let's go get this grace over here. Um, and then we will probably come back because I think we're going to need the spirit ashes. Shadow Realm Realm 7. Shadow Realm Rune. I keep saying Shadow Rune Realm something. Something along those lines. Okay, this guy. I want his hammer. Yeah, okay. Um, I'm not sure brother ends up dead. I don't think we have the weapon to be able to kill him. But what we can do is grab this and uh, farm some runes. Alright, so if I stand on this, this guy should wake up and do a tornado. Yeah, there we go. Nice. And then we can... Nice. I need to do it again. That was like 13,000 runes, I guess. Yep, that worked. Okay. Um, let's go upgrade the sword and then we'll see if I'm turning it into a night sword or a darkness sword or a, I think, I think darkness is going to be cooler at least. So I should upgrade that sword and then there's somewhere in these ruins that we can change it to be like a super cool sword. Nice. And then we will dump everything else into strength for now. Maybe we should start doing some faith too. So we're at 20 strength. What if we started doing... We need intelligence and faith, honestly. I think we'll do that first. All right. If we were here. Okay, so that is next to that divine beast dancing lion thing. I'm not sure how we get over there. Um, maybe you can jump down from up there. Still seems a little sketchy to me though, but... Not sure if there's any other options, so let's see if we can make this. Oh yeah, forgot about. There's a jump down here, so we're good. Is that is that stone down here? I don't remember where it is. I think this is just going to over here. Yeah, I don't I don't think that this is particularly useful. Yeah, these guys are a problem though. Can't really just run past them, which is a problem. Let's, no, 
Dude, I died before I even touched the ground. Oh my gosh. All right, where are we? Okay, we're right over here. Which I think is overall where we want to be, except for I don't think that's where we want to be for the, the thingy majigger, you know? So what are the options for getting up there? Is there an elevator maybe? Yep, found the elevator. That's a tricky little elevator to find. Now, this divine beast does death blight if I remember correctly, which is just going to be awful. So I'm not entirely sure if we're actually going to kill him or if there's a way just to get the sort of darkness or light or whichever one we're doing. Please be like right here. No, it's not. OK, I mean, yeah, is it only available after you kill the lion? Maybe. OK, well, we woke him up, so. <laughs> OK. Like, oh my gosh, that is so annoying. Okay, I can't, I, I, I couldn't see what was going on, man. Like seriously. Okay, we, this is the word. Why would somebody do this? All right. Um, I guess let's try and go kill Ramana. See, the problem is, is I haven't found like a overarching crazy weapon yet. Ow. Nice. Okay. Well, oh, good Lord. Have mercy. Oh, I think I'm dead. <laughs> uh, maybe, mm, I don't know. I'm definitely more comfortable with the backhand blades with as far as time goes. That's fine. Tough scene. Tough scene for the boys. Okay. Good looks. Great job, guys. Yeah, I mean, there is nothing. Okay, let's go see if we can get Dry Leaf Dane stuff. Get his hands and feet. And then um, maybe that'll have a better chance at doing some poise damage. I'm not gonna have any runes, but we can we can we can figure out runes. All right, Dreadly Dane, it is time to meet your maker. Um, I think we're just gonna poke with uh, the katana. Oh my gosh, okay, that's a projectile. I love how NPC fights are just literally just running around from each other. Nice. That's fine. So now we have his hands and feet, I think, or maybe it's just his feet. We do get his hat. His hat is the most important thing, okay. Okay, so that's his arts. Let's um, let's go upgrade these. They're probably regular smithing stones. Oh, wow, that's a lot of runes. Okay, a lot more runes than I thought. So yeah, we'll definitely be able to upgrade this. Is smithing stones perfect? Poise though, I don't know, man. I his hat might be worth it. Fifty poise is a good spot to be at. So, I mean, this will at least be a different experience, right? Okay, it's not very strong. I really expect it to be strong though. 
I don't know. Did I? Kinda. Oh no, dude, I just wanna heal. Oh my gosh, okay. That might have been a waste of money. I'm sure it scales like S with decks though, so maybe it's just we're just not high enough decks for it to be good. Great. Come on, get me out of there, dog. Dude, I, I you can't roll fast enough. You can't roll fast enough to be able to do that like consecutive. I don't know what I was doing before, but it was working. It's working real well, actually. You you can't do anything. You just get stuck and there's nothing you can do. That time it works fine. I got lucky there. Okay, let's the counter blessings right here, okay? No. <sighs> wow, okay. Maybe we go back and forth between um these two weapons. Proc Frost, switch over to the Poise Monster, and then Proc Frost again, and, you know, just go back and forth. Nice. There we go. Big damage. Oh, this is a bad idea. Nice. Actually got our pass this time. Only to follow up by a weirder attack. Goodbye. All right. Well, at least we have a few rem or we have what two remembrances down 400,000. Thank the Lord. Get some runes. OK, so what do we want to use? So there's this sword, which eventually will turn it into something. There's this one, which needs 16 int. I feel like everything really needs faith in this DLC, except for like the Starline sword, maybe. Everything else I know needs like a good amount of faith. But see, if we're going this way, then we're gonna be, let's get 18 faith and then put the rest in strength. 18 and strength. Oh, baby. We have so many levels. Yeah, how much room? Okay, so let's go see if we can upgrade one of these heavier weapons. Okay, so you take somber, you take smithing. Okay, um, somber we can, uh, we cannot do. Yeah, we don't have any normal smithing stones. So let's see if we can get this one online. Yeah, plus six is not gonna be enough. Okay, um, let's go over here to the Western Nameless Mausoleum and see if we can kill this guy. Um, cause we tried the backhand blades on him last time, which didn't really do much of anything as far as like pulling him out of his stance. But I'm thinking that the Great Katana, I don't think we tried the Great Katana, which should be able to, to help with that. All right, let's, uh, let's see if we can kill this guy with this. Nice. This first great. I'll probably stun him out of everything except for that. Yeah. Nice. 
we do need to get that crossbow because i figured out that it's a pretty good way to cheese that um uh that other divine beast divine lion whatever oh okay i think jump r are technically probably better but they might miss and i i don't want to miss and then get clocked so oh i didn't know that, that would work bodied oh we gotta bleed wow okay there we go so now we have runes to go level up hopefully both of those weapons maybe only one uh there is the sword of solitude which we should get right here i don't really know a whole lot about it i mean it's it's, it's probably pretty good actually um oh, 70 000 runes isn't gonna be enough so we killed ramana where do you get that uh bow or that crossbow uh okay so we can get the wing stance that's a positive and then that crossbow should be over here somewhere i think we'll see if that works actually i wonder if you can run it on this no i think it has to be a light great sword or a light sword or we'll come back for that i'm not i'm not sure what, what's going on over there all right nice okay so we got that ash of war that is goaded we definitely could kill the sleeping thing down here if we wanted to. Let's go get uh, this crossbow first. Yeah, it's this. Okay. Might be it. Might not be it. Uh, we don't need to go down here. Let's go to this ruined forge lava intake. I think that this is a dungeon. Oh, it's the repeating crossbow. Ah, okay. 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 So I messed up. My bad. It's a repeating crossbow. I think we'll use this to, um, we'll use this to hopefully cheese the uh, other divine beast. Ah. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, now these guys decide to care about me. Okay, that's fine. So now we have that, which is good. We can't really do anything with it at the moment. I feel decent about Rolana now. So let's see if, let's give her a couple, a couple takes, depending on how that goes. Yeah, I don't know. We'll go from there. Okay, not a good start. Really not a good start. Come on, Tiger. Nice. Okay, I'll take that. Bodies. Okay, so that was not. Oh my gosh. Okay, she's definitely beatable. We just gotta not suck, which is, I mean, that, that's a good place to be in, right? You know, it's it's beatable. Just you gotta not suck. We can we can we can deal with that. We can deal with beatable, but not suck. Oh, I forgot that's like a. Ooh. How did, the la how did the last one hit me? We kind of need her runes to be able to upgrade this repeating crossbow. The reason I'm doing that is because I want to be able to use that altar to um, upgrade that sort of whatever. And definitely a little bit more risky, which is not good. I'll take that, but like... Okay, yeah, that. Wake up, bro. Wake up. Nice. It's kind of hard to dodge, to be honest. Ah, oh, great. What? Okay, well, I still don't have that timing down, clearly. Nice. 
Nice. We haven't gotten a bleed. Oh my gosh, bro. Rolana actually might be the second hardest boss in this DLC. Alright, um, let's take our talent elsewhere. We said we were going to go to this dungeon. This dungeon should give us enough runes to do something, so... There was something in there, but... It... I hope that there's actually a boss in here. Because the other one didn't have a boss. Okay, well, I can't use my map and cup. Never seen that before. Okay. Another potnate cookbook. I don't, I don't really know what these potnates really do. I actually haven't looked at any of the cookbooks, if we're being honest. Like, so far, I just feel like these little, uh, these little dungeons right here are just loot factories, which is obviously, you know, helpful. But I've yet to see, like... I didn't see a boss in the other one. Okay, that is weak. Okay, Sombra 6. Hmm. That's definitely interesting. Okay. Um, where do we want to go next? I mean, we can start dealing with Mesmer and all his folks, or we can go back in here. Did I hate these Ember Mesmer things? They're so annoying. There we go, stagger. Okay, so they just get bodied by anything relatively heavy. Nice. Okay, I will take that. I do appreciate even the, the baby mobs having dropping a whole lot more runes. So that is much appreciated. Thank you, FromSoft. Like give me a thousand for these guys. Much appreciated. There we go. Skadoo is empowered, and we can do that. And we are at mass flasks. Okay, that's awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and go get all the way to Mesmer's Gate and then we'll go upgrade and do stuff. Okay, this dude's annoying. All right, so this is the thing that makes those guys go upward, which is what we need in order to get to Mesmer, to seventh floor. Wing Serpent Helm, okay, that's pretty cool. Seems pretty much better in every single way. Now, the hat. I'd like to run the hat. A skitty fragment, nice. And yeah, Messimer. Okay. Um Yeah, this DLC is so much fun. Don't have a nine, that's a problem. And this is gonna cost so much money, so we're not gonna be able to do this, but I don't even know how high we got. Alright. Uh let's go. Yeah, let's let's go try Messimer. Did we still only have two talisman slots and we're wearing trashy stuff, man? I mean, that's a look, baby. That is a look. And we're, we're probably going to rock something similar to this for the rest of the run, dude. That's awesome. All right, we got two weapons to run on Mesmer. Yeah, it's been a while since I fought him. Oh, there we go. Okay, that, that was a warm up, but yeah, that that is by cool the the or by by cool that is by far the coolest uh, like grab animation in the entire game. So this is the move right here, baby. Oh, baby girl. Okay. Dude, they did such a good job with these boss fights. I mean, between, like, as far as... Oh, okay. Radon, Radon's kind of annoying. I think my f my favorite fight is probably this one. My favorite boss in the entire thing is Midra by far. She's 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 the coolest boss fight. I don't, I don't care what anybody says. Ow. Whoops. Yeah, okay. I mean, I'm a little out of touch with Mesmer. Oh, come on. Oh, it's too far away.
Yeah, only time for one. Nice. Oh. Oh my. Oh, I'm still alive. I thought it was a grab. Okay. Yeah, I'm not quite good with the snakes yet. You know, I'm not a fan of snakes in general. So snakes are a little difficult. That's such a cool finisher, dude. I don't even care that I died. What? Sure, we're gonna get that. Okay, goodbye, Mesmer. Uh, that was very anticlimactic. Sorry, I didn't anticipate actually killing him there. I don't remember how many words he gives. Uh, let's see. 400,000? Okay, that's good. Um, I don't think we're going to use his remembrance. I've used his remembrance before. I'm like, it was fine. Nothing wrong with it. Then we wanted to do... And I'm not going to worry about this. Then there's this, which honestly might be good. And then there's also the repeating crossbow, which we need to, okay, we don't have an eight. So we need an eight. Yeah, we don't have any nines, which we could use, could use a revered spirit ash to get us to nine. Not really worried about that. Okay, um, so now we got a bunch of new weapons to try. I don't know, we'll see. No status effects though, so this this might be a problem. I mean, it did a lot of damage. There we go. I mean, I definitely like it. That's not a question. And not quite time for two charge R2s. Come on. Get in there. Yes. Nice. I mean, I, I definitely like this. Just tank it. I mean, I like it. I like the moveset set a lot. It's pretty it's powerful. It's pretty powerful. I mean it's definitely powerful. Three hundred and eleven thousand, I think I think we just go into endurance, unfortunately. I mean I, I definitely do like this thing, so. Alright, what are we getting from him? Fire knife gauntlets, okay. So there's uh, head across the beam.
Nice. Okay, I'll take that. Can we jump onto the hand? I think this is a talisman, actually. This is definitely a talisman, but you know, why not? Uh, yeah, Project Talisman 3. Okay, we're going to uh, use our 3. Um, so, Talisman. Okay, so back here, there's a bunch of Scoot Tree fragments. We can also go down here. And there's just, there's a lot that we can do. Do we want to go ahead and burn the tree and try and kill that guy? Because he'll give us a lot of runes and then I think... Keyword think. I think he's supposed to unlock a place for us to turn this into the sort of darkness or the sort of or the uh, sort of light, which I want to use it, which I'm not sure if we'll have the faith for it. I wonder if I can like replenish. Bro, you're not going to come over here? There we go. Jeez. Buddy, I need you to... Where's your brother going? I mean, we have good weapons now. Like, we could definitely kill him. Uh, okay. Let's try this one. Bro's gotta be so close to staggering. Okay, well, there goes that. We definitely didn't have enough bolts to kill him, though. I'm not sure if you can, like, restock mid-aggro, right? Bro, what is even go- What was even going on? I got pushed into a pillar and I couldn't do anything. In the main game, I don't- I I'm sure that there's an instance somewhere, but I, I just don't remember- like the problems that I'm having with these bosses where it's like I get pushed into a pillar I'm inside them like I, I just don't remember that type of stuff with the base game and that doesn't mean that didn't happen but come on man oh no oh no why did they give him death blight like Can you please stop, dude? I'm trying to deal with all of your stupid frogs. Hold on, I'm almost done. Oh my gosh, bro, I am almost done, all right? I hate this one, dude. I'm not fighting this. This is trash. Like, the frogs? Come on, man. What's up with the frogs? Nobody cares about the frogs. All right, um, right, let's go burn this stupid thing. And then we might go to a near Elim. Bro, I have no idea what's going on. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Loser. That was awful. Okay, well, we can just start doing that from now on. Uh, I don't see anything over here, bro. Like, um, yeah, I don't see anything over here, bro. Okay, let's hop down here, I guess. Oh, we're good for dash. Appreciate that. How are you? Where did you come from? I killed all the guys up here. Yeah, whatever, dude. I, I just... You can't bother me at this point in time, brother. Now, this is probably the spiral staircase side of grace. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. So that's their second staircase. Can we make it from here? Nice. Oh my, there was a hole there. How did anybody find this generically? Like seriously, like there's no way anybody found this just like screwing around. I mean, clearly here it is, but like no way. Euphoria, you don't have enough face for it. You need 18 face. We need six more face, sorry. Between this and probe, uh, we might be able to go ahead and cover Don, I don't know. I don't remember how good I am at the fight. <laughs> Ugh. Where did that guy come from? Oh, hello. I'm going to take a pass on all of that. <laughs> no, thank you. 
Skidoo fragment. All right, let's level up and we can definitely level up our Skidoo. All right, then let's level up our face. We are four fate away. Uh, let's sit right here and see if we can add a cold attunement to this. Sure, I mean, I, I don't mind beating a couple other people getting some more runes. How dare you? Oh, don't you dare, sorry. Quality. Yeah, I'm not sure this is the move. Yeah, no, I'm not the move. Yeah, see that that is ridiculous. Yeah, these guys are annoying. I mean the the Dragon Hunter Katana we could always use. We could grab something and start trying to parry or something. I don't know. Okay. Apparently that isn't dodge enough. Dude, I hate NPC fights so much. I'm not sure if we're gonna sit here and finish this, but Let me roll. And now we just gotta run around for a while. Let me, thank you. I mean, that's fine. This will just be a 20 minute fight and I'll run around the edges until we're done. <laughs> like there's, how did they intend for this fight to go? Like, I know you can summon like these cooperators to help you or whatever. But like outside of that, how did you expect this to go? How did she get it off? One more attempt and then like, oh my gosh, dude, I hate this fight so much. Like it's... Uh... Yeah, that's trash. Okay, whatever. There's other stuff that we can do. There's a lot of other stuff we can do. Go down over here first. I don't think we have anything that really does lightning damage though, which could be a problem. Oh yeah, we do. We have that stupid axe. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Um, yeah. And then we got we got to blow some whistles. I think. Now I think we just drop down here. I don't remember that being anything important. So, oh. <laughs> bro. There we go. Good job. I remember there being a few interesting places down here. I don't, don't quite. Oh, hi. Okay, let's just, you got it. You got it. Nice. Ugh. Ugh. Dude, I love this thing so much. It's just, it's just so beefy, man. It is a beefcake and a half. So I'm pretty sure that this is pretty much like people think that this is the best weapon in the DLC. I might be completely off base, but I don't think I am. I think people really like that. So I'm excited to get to try it out eventually. Okay. Let's see. Is this a scoot tree fragment? I think it is. How do this be here? Okay. I think this is a cookbook. No, fine. Oh my gosh. It scared the crap out of me. Just die. Just die. Perfect. So glad we got that. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. This is another one of these guys. That's fine. Oh, this looks like the entrance to Shadow Keep. I don't know if I've been down here because I don't remember this. Battlefield Priest Cookbook. Okay. 
At some point, we got to go down some of the elevators, right? Actually, this might be this might be the boss fight for uh, the tree. What is this? Where am I? Wait, is is this the entrance to the sunflower guy? I, I really do not remember it being like this. I guess it is. I, I just don't remember it being like this at all, but okay. Iris of Grace. Okay, screw you. Actually, technically, these are kind of good occasionally. Oh, yeah, this is a sunflower guy. I think this is just trash. Oh, America's Run. Hold on. Uh, nice. Okay. All right, let, let's try this. I, I'm not overly concerned with this fight. I don't remember it being very hard. I did think it was really weird, but cool, I guess. Okay, this is doing a lot less damage than I thought it was going to. Bonk. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and switch to these. Dude, they, they created some of the weirdest movesets I've ever seen. I forgot that we that's just not a good attack here. Ow. Okay, that's fine, dude. That was awful. <laughs> it just felt so tanky. Couldn't actually hit the head. Where's the head? Can't see it. Bru Ow. Okay. I... Uh... <laughs> This is just pain. Like, th this boss is so weird, man. Like, it, it, it is just so weird. How did that hit me? Okay. I don't have the patience for this right now, man. Like, this thing frustrates me so much. You can barely hit it. We have the grace, so we can come back. I mean, we could always go deal with Needle Knight Leda and her goofballs, but I'm gonna take a pass on that one for now. Um, I think this is the right area. No, where am I? Blessed bone shard that probably didn't do anything. Okay, so this goes up to the top. I remember this. I also remember this being an absolute mess up here. I don't remember this area too well. I think that this is uh, this is either two things. This is either what one makes significantly more sense than the other. So let's get that out of the way. This is either how we get to Commander Gauss and um, that room where you do this Oh Mother Val thing. This is the way to Midra. I don't remember where I'm supposed to be going. Uh, but I feel more comfortable with this thing, so. Wrath from afar, okay. Now this should be the way to Commander Gauss. Having said that, I don't know what we're gonna use on him either. I don't feel very strong. People talked about that so much higher than, is it bad that I'm kind of disappointed? Maybe, maybe I just don't understand the damage it does. Okay, Let, let's give it the benefit of the doubt. Let's handle the flying pig. Okay, good job. Okay, I, I just love this fight so much. Let's have, hear me out, let's have a pig flop around like a fish, a guy with a gigantic sword on his back, and let's call it a day. Okay, we cannot poison that, understood. Come on. Just let me get it off. I bet you that does killer damage. What? Okay, well, uh, don't... Uh, yeah. Yeah, just... Yeah. I don't even know if we're going to be able to get this actual war off, honestly. Here? Okay, it's not, it's not good like that. Nice. What?! that all right we're, we're putting down the te euphoria temporarily all right or maybe permanently i don't know yet but 
But what I can tell you is we're not doing what we just did. Okay, dude. Yeah, I do. I don't like this fight. I'm not saying it's bad or anything like that. I just don't like it, like at all. I just find it super annoying. Dude, I don't have time to recover. Flying pig. There we go. No stagger, really? There we go. Okay. Nice. Okay, goodbye. Okay, now that time I kind of got into a little bit of rhythm and I understood how somebody could find it appealing. Do I like it? Still no. But I, I, I for a second there, I understood why somebody didn't hate this. And honestly, it had a bit of nostalgia for me. It kind of felt like a Zelda boss fight, but but Zeldas were, you know, Zelda, so they were Zelda. All right, let's get a bunch of skidoo trees. I think there's five back here. Unfortunately, I think it only gets us up one more. What is this? Okay, plus one shard. Nobody cares about these. We can go to Tree Worship Sanctum. Still haven't done that. We could also... Try and go down to this mausoleum. There's, um, I think there's a good, uh, great katana down here somewhere. Runes of Unti. So we have to throw, in order to get to the place that we want to go, we have to throw a pot, a furnace pot, but I don't know how to get a furnace pot. Yeah, this feels right. I, I've been down here before for sure. All right. And I smack. Wait, hold on. This is not where I'm meant to be. Oh, wait, yeah, it is. I, I remember I smacked that for... I, I don't remember why I smacked it, but it ended up being the right place. Runes of Unti. So this is also where we can upgrade to the Sword of Light or Sword of Darkness, actually. All right. A hefty Furnace Pot. Inventory. Then let's put this right there. And then we're going to throw it on that guy. Uh, I think this was a furnace visage, 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 anything notable. All right, let's do that. Come on, brother. Yes, it worked. Now, where does he go? Does he become a bad guy? Oh, he does. Oh, he's doing the tornado. Is there a way to actually dodge this other than just run away? No. Dude, I don't know what causes him to stagger. Ow. Like, is it a certain amount of hits or a certain amount of damage? I don't know. Do, when are you supposed to roll? Uh, you, you can't dodge it. I'm... I'm I don't know who's going to have more crit damage, but... I'm gonna try this one. Uh, dude is beefy. That did so much damage too. Oh my gosh, dude. I Okay, at this point, I say we just full send, upgrade our sword. 
I think I should have enough time to get behind him because we did last time. Yep. Nice. Okay, where's his altar? It's right there. Perfect. To the dark. Yes. Sword of darkness. Okay. It said to the dark or to the light, but I only see the dark one. That's fine. Okay. Uh, do we need to go back here? Let's, I guess let's try and finish this thing. I mean, we have lots of new toys, so why not? All right, let's see what the damage is like on this. Ow. Surprisingly good. Okay, somehow didn't die. Appreciate that. Oh, nice. Nice. All right, we should just be able to whack on it now. I'm having an easier time hitting it, which makes no sense. It's a smaller sword, but... Nice lag. Not a good time for lag. All right, let's just whack at the base, I guess. All right, we're putting Lion's Claw on the hammer and we're just gonna go to ham because I don't think that I can get poise broken out of it. What's what's our stance? 59, yeah, we should be good. Yeah, Lion's Claw, the big kahuna. Pretty sure kahuna's a fish. Where's that face, brother? Uh. 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 Oh, he can stagger. Okay. Does it, does he, I didn't know he could stagger like that. Oh, not what I expected to happen. Oh, and he, this one has full health because I accidentally killed the other one. Like that's kind of trash, but okay. All right, where's that face, brother? Oh, okay, I didn't know you had a follow up to that. Uh, come on. Uh. Ooh, that was close. Ow, okay, just die. Thank you. Uh, scooter tree, bop, bop. Okay, nice. Yo, where are you gonna go, brother? Okay. Okay, just one. You can do one. It's fine. Ow. Okay. Ow. Yeah, whatever, I just don't care. Just beat the crap out of him, please. Just a frost proc would do? Okay, thank you, bye. Beyond. Make us great run. I forgot that we got that here. Yeah, I'm not using his remembrance. Screw that, bro. Uh, I don't know that we need this for anything. Okay. Um, So we've gotten a lot of the side quest stuff done, which is good. Um... I guess let's go try the uh, almost a few champs. All right, so pretty much we can do this. Is that chargeable? Okay, that's one dead. Nice. Dude, I don't even care if this is like a manly fight or not at this point. I just want to win. <laughs> that is it. That is all I care about at this point in time. That damage negation definitely helps though. Oh, of course he gets iframes there. Bonk. I mean, the bonk does plenty of damage. 
don't technically need to use savage lions great claw or whatever bonk ah plus with the bonks at least we can recover fast enough for Leda to not hurt us bonk I mean if you have a powerful weapon then I guess this is fine that staggers them or stuns them I mean, one more Savage Lion's Great Call would kill him, but there's Leda. Bonk. Bonk. Goodbye. All right, now we should just be able to cheese her. Bonk. Bro, what? Okay, that's bad. That one equals bad. Bonk. Bonk. Gotta be careful about the... She has her... Thingy out. How does she... Okay, let me recover like that, dog. See what happens to her if I can recover like that. Nice. That wasn't a terrible trade, it just wasn't a good one. And bonk. Oh, baby girl. <sighs> bonk goes hard. 300,000, okay, I'll take that. All right, let's loot the boys. Flax, which is apparently really good. Um, didn't realize how good it was when I first saw it. Leda, and then now we just have Redaniel. I think I know what we're gonna use on Redan. Not sure if I wanna fight him right now. Actually, I don't. <laughs> I think, um, cause I wanna get that uh, talisman get what it is, but it's like uh, America's hair or something. It, it's definitely not called America's hair, but I think it's something along the lines of that. And uh, I want to have that in my arsenal before anything else. Now the flax does have a really interesting Ash of War. Can we wield it? We can. Where do we use it though? We don't really need it at this point. I mean, I'm really just enjoying the bonk fest. If we're just being 100% honest, I hope it's not boring, but like it's fun. How much do we care? I mean, nine damage a hit. Oh wait, hold on. We're not gonna be using this on Redon. Okay, sorry. That just answered that question. Um, yeah, cause we're gonna be using um, the backhand blade on Redon for sure. Let's go down here. Maybe we'll go ahead and kill um, the putrescent knight. Uh, we definitely should be fine to be able to handle the things now. Yeah, so we, we got some we got some gathering to do before we, before we go. Can I sneak up on this one? You sneak up on a bird. Oh, baby girl. Bonk. Perfect. I think the putrescent knight is actually a uh, weak to holy, so that'll be helpful. Now, do I remember where to go? Definitely not. Oh, it's up there, I think. Okay. Odd. And we got all the birds. The burges. I mean, what else could we use? We could we could use another holy weapon. But like Euphoria would probably be pretty good here. Uh, I forgot it was three or I didn't know it was three. Ow. Ow. Okay, I was trying to heal that entire time. Do I got a cut on my hand? That hurt. Do you want to try Euphoria? Does more holy damage, actually. But it probably does less... Ah, let's give it a shot. Why not? Alright. Okay, so it does good damage. Just gotta be able to hit the thing. Oh, follow up bonk. I mean, I've only fought this boss once. Oh yeah, forgot fire. Ow, okay. Dude, it... 
It's so hard to hit this stupid thing. But then you can hit it here. Okay, that does not do what I thought it would. Nice. I don't know how I dodged that. Uh, I didn't dodge that one. Oh my god, bro. Okay, we're not using Euphoria. Not because it's bad, but because I can't hit the stupid thing. And when you have a gigantic gavel, it's hard to hit. Or it's hard to miss. So, gigantic gavel it is. Dude, my eyes freaking burn, bro. Okay, this is a good amount of damage. Like you just, it, it, it's just so hard to hit, like. Like, is it super cool for sure? But like, you can't hit the stupid thing. Oh, that was bad. Ow. I mean, I, I don't, I didn't even get to see what it did, to be honest. Come here, brother. Goodbye. Ow. Guess I deserve that. Uh, yeah. Um, we could get the putrescent cleaver, but we're not going to have the, uh, int to be able to do it. So we're not going to, I think there's some sort of saint trainer or something down here. Embed Nectar? Is that like a... What's going on here? What did I just... Oh. Bro, what? Who does that? Uh, who, who does that? Can I kill this thing? Done with your shenanigans. Okay, so that one's done. It's positive. Still got Mateer. Radagon and Midra. Or not Radagon, Radon. All right, uh, where is this braid? I think it's back here, maybe. Okay, so let's go uh, Shadow Keep back gate. It's either here or the Ruins of Unti, and I don't know which. Uh, no, Golden Braid. That's what it is. Yeah, okay, we're in the right. We're going to the right area. Okay, you can just stay here forever. Shaman Village. I feel like this is supposed to be special somehow, but I also don't know what this does. Minor Erd Tree. I never figured out what that was. Ah. Golden Braid. Beautiful. Holy damage resistance and it's 22%. I guess we can go test our Dawn, see how he's doing. Now, there's a very specific reason we're using the backhand blade, and that is because blind spot uh, thing is one of the very few ways that you can dodge his like really quick slice that's technically undodgeable unless if you use very specific game mechanics. Whoops. Ow. Yep, see, that is, that worked. That worked, wow, okay. Nice lag. That was not a good time to lag, brother. Okay, yeah, I mean, I got hit with lag. I, I felt I felt pretty good about all that, though. I will say, we don't do a ton of damage, but 
just kind of is what it is if we're going to use I, I would rather be able to dodge his only like really 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 hard uh move to dodge than um than be able to do more damage i think See, if you're like not in front, like if you're okay, so that attack technically is dodgeable if you're completely on his hip. But like from that position, it's not dodgeable. Nice. Okay, yeah, I, I don't know what happened there. See, I gotta be ready to hit that L2. That attack is hilarious. t -pose. okay, I don't think we're gonna be able to get out of this one. Nope. I didn't know what was going on. Nice. Uh, no, we're not gonna be able to get out of this one either. Oh, we rolled it though. Nice. I don't know if there's a sure way to dodge that other than cheesing it. I do know people are cheesing it. I don't really even know how. Okay, yeah, I deserve that one. Did not play that very well. Nice. There's two. T pose. Yes, sir. That is so ridiculous. I love it. Just pretend like I didn't heal. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm sorry. That was bad. Ow. Oh, no. Now we're dead. Yeah, dude, that one is ridiculous. Nope, cannot blind spot that. That is a beatdown, brother. Dude, the music is just so good, man. I need to start. It's just such a habit to roll. Bonk. Okay. Phase two. I also just had a pretty good idea. I'll just, oh, okay. I'll, I'll wait to share it if we die again. Because if we don't die, then we don't need it. Honestly, I wasn't really sure what just happened there. So it looks like you can just roll that like normal. Boop, 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 and boop. Two hits. Okay. Such a habit to roll, man. Okay, heal. All right, run, 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 run. Bonk. Come on, bro. Can I use this to heal? 
Okay. I made a mistake there. When you went for the cross, I tried to do the backstab or the blind spot and that did not work. I'm just fine. Okay, so you should roll that. I don't think you have to, but you definitely should. Let's do heals. Nice, okay. Well, Redon's down. I will take that, brother. Remember to have gotten a lord. Um I got the um what I get last time. I got the light one last time. Uh didn't like it. Um the Ash of War did not really like it. So this time I guess let's go see what the other parts of the remembrance is. I know one's a faith thing that we won't be able to use. The thing. Okay, so there's Lord and Light. Light of Mikola annihilates foes the pillar of light. I mean, we might as well. I mean, it's only like uh, we're not going to have the intelligence. Do we really need it? I mean, no, but we're going to get it. Um, and we're actually going to see if we can get this online. All right, so now I can either try and remember how to go get to Midra or Matir. Let, let's just... Okay, so yeah, that does look like what we're supposed to do right there. So we're gonna go try and do it. Uh, and we can go back to um, just wielding that as heavy load. Are you joking? Okay, uh, we'll go back to our uh, our bonk machine. Dude, this thing is awesome. I don't know a way to actually dodge those. Maybe by getting off your horse. All right, I think we have the finger. Oh no. Did we not have the finger horn? I could have sworn we had the finger horn. Did we not talk to them? Hold on. What? Oh, I guess I didn't. Oh, it's unfortunate. Try this again. Uh, I don't remember how to get to Midra. Uh, it's not the runes of Unti. Thank you. Okay. You definitely go through. Oh yeah, we've we've already been over this. I'm sorry. I'm being dumb. You go uh go through the. F some runes. Oh man. Then we'll have to go blow the other horn and we'll come back. Nice. Okay, there's one horn. Then we have the grace for the next one. Uh, this one's harder to deal with. And then we just go back and then we're good. Actually, I think I want to finish with Bale. A, because I have to learn him and then B, he, he's definitely like top three coolest boss. All right, so now we got to watch out for worms because the worms be worming, my friend. Having to perfectly time it every single time. Oh, I'm not sure how they missed, but horn number two. Yeah, okay. All right, so now let's go to cathedral. Got to talk to this brother, I think. I I R C. Um, I think she's in water, so we're gonna want to use lightning damage. Uh, yeah, we we don't care. I th I think he's gone whenever we sleep. Am I right? Uh, and I also think that this is the last grace before the fight, so. Uh, I don't know, Cole. How, how much extra damage does putting lightning on it do? We can't put lightning set. Oh, wait, we don't have the thingy. No wonder. Okay, now he's gone. Perfect. What are you looking at? Yeah, this. I think there's an NPC here. I killed it last time. Not sure if you have to kill it, but I did. Nice. Okay. Okay, let's stop this. Die. Just die. Thank you. Not that hard. Flaws of Night. I think those are pretty good. I haven't gotten to use them yet, though. Now, I think we just blow on this. That's what she said. And then um, then, then we're in the fight, so. Yep, and we're in the fight. Okay, this thing is so gross. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. I mean, damage is fine. 
How? I think. Okay. Slammer fist. Oh, nice. Okay, can we get to the face? Oh. I guess it's to the thumbprint? Fingerprint? Not a face, I don't guess. And that's the stagger? Or not? Ow. Okay. That staggered, though. Alright. The face. I don't even remember what phase two was. Okay, floating hand? Bro, what is going on? I do remember this fight, like, being like, I have no idea what's going on. Okay, surprised that. Okay, they're just holes? What are these things? Uh, they're probably bombs. Ow. Yeah, this fight is a disaster. Okay. Pure disaster. Oh, man. So much health. Poise is not high, though, which is positive. Ow. Oh, okay. A little light on that. It's got to be close to staggering. There we go. Ugh. Okay, let's heal. I think that's the final one. That's not too hard to it. What? Oh yeah, this thing. Okay. No, whoops. All of her attacks look the same, too. Okay, except for this one. This one means balls. Nice. Yeah, grab, probably not a good idea. Okay, I, I don't want to deal with this anymore. <laughs> okay. Uh, this still a super weird fight, man. A super, super weird fight for me. So I just got Midrim. Uh, let's see if we can get to those catacombs, which are down in here. Uh, pillar path, waypoint. I don't remember what this is. Uh, okay, I think I've gone too far. I've definitely gone too far. Okay, back. Watch this not even be in this ravine, it's in a different one. Wow. I did not know you get iframes when uh, hitting inside of Grace. That is something. All right, so we gotta go down here somewhere. We we'll go to the Dark Light Catacombs, and after we get to the Dark Light Catacombs, we go to the Abysmal Woods, and then we just continue to do the thing. Yeah, so um, ever since Microsoft had that outage, I keep getting this stupid sign-in screen, and it's completely random. Yes, sir. And we'll get to the Abysmal Woods through here. No, Abyssal Woods, not Abysmal, sorry. Not sure if there's anywhere where you can buy the lantern. Like this lights up part of it, but not like most of it. So still can't see most of the entire map. Oh, apparently these guys uh, drop their little pogo sticks and it's um, it's a serpent something. Looks pretty cool. It's something that um, at some point I might farm. Definitely not now, but. Uh, goodbye. Yoink. Goodbye. Bonk. Ah. Okay, so those ricochet. I wonder if if you get that spell, if it also ricochets. If not, that's super cheap. Yep. And trying to remember, is this the Inquisitor or is that later? Is it the if it's the Inquisitor, we want to not use holy damage. We'll go with that. 
And it is, okay. I just love how all this boss does is summons. Dude, what is up with them and the freaking spinning attacks? I was hoping that this would like do some poise damage, but it doesn't seem to be doing that. Just tank it, just tank it. <laughs> Got him. Yeah, I, I don't like that fight. It's probably one of the only ones in this DLC that I just I, I just don't like it. Um, I'm not a fan of I don't really like summons. Um, like if you want to use them, cool. Like it, it's not like a quote unquote manly thing or whatever like that. It's not it's not about that. It's just I don't like using summons because it screws up with the AI. And then when you have summons like this, where they just keep on resummoning, it, it's just so annoying. All right, for second graveyard. All right, so what are our two directions? We can either go over here, or we can go this way. I think we want to go this way. Yep, that's the right way. Just don't hit the reeds that make noise. I don't know where you, how far you go, but I'm just gonna keep going. Yep, I think this is the right direction. Let me just keep going straight, and then we should get there. Yep, I can see it. Now we can see if I can remember how to navigate this place. <laughs> because I don't remember. Oh yeah, these guys are here. That That's why I remember sneaking around. It's because I didn't want to deal with these guys. Boop. Shadow Realm Rune. Don't really need that anymore, but that's okay. Bonk. Um, so we got a little bit of parkour to do, I think. No? Oh, I, I jumped over in that window for whatever reason last time we were here. Back here. Bonk. Uh, that looks like it. Uh, oh yeah, that painting. There's a lever somewhere that we have to, nope, 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 nope. Not touching that guy. Ah, all right. I don't, I, I don't know how Holy holds up against Midra. Uh, I mean, I guess we'll start with this. I don't think Midra bleeds. She does, it's kind of weird, but I don't think she bleeds. We'll try the gigantic hammer first and then we'll go from there. Bonk. Shut up. Ah. Uh, there is okay. Okay. You're so close to stagger. You're just stagger already. Thank you. Okay. Um, I mean, the weapon was fine. I'm not really sure what happened there. I think we have to kill the Nyarg guy. Narg. Ow. Yeah, I didn't really get to experience this. Oh. I didn't die. Okay, that's gnarly. Ow. Okay, nice. Yeah, I remember Midra being so much easier. Probably because we're using Starfist and just crazy, crazy like buildups and crazy stance damage. Ow. Okay. Nice lag. Come on. I got hit with so much lag. Uh, I just wish the FPS was consistent on this, which I mean, uh, part of it is definitely the game. The other part of it is, I think I, I have a memory problem. 
um like my computer is willing to use a whole lot more memory on like subtask than it should for for no reason so i gotta fix that so Nice. Oh, whoops. Okay, come on. There we go. Okay. Quality. Ow. Nice. Stagger? Nice. Made her come back to Earth. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm not sure if you actually can jump over that or if I got lucky. But that was kind of wild. Goodbye. Ah, <sighs> that's a fun fight. I'm not very good at it yet, but that is definitely a fun fight. All right. Now we have Bale. Which I actually don't know how to get to. All right, uh, so bail. I came over here once with Igon, and that worked. So let's let's try this again. Yeah, I think I think you just go this way. Did I still get invaded. Or th yeah, I think I get invaded by like Dragon Hunter. What's his face? Yeah, that's right. All right, come here, birdie. Ancient Dragon Man. That is such a great name. Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye, Ancient Dragon Man. And then this takes us to the place where Ancient Dragon Man lives. Yeah, Dragon's Pit, and then you go through. Yeah, okay. I remember this. Kind of. If I remember correctly, the goal is just to keep going downward until you hit Dragon Man. Everything's done for quality. I hope there's a Stake America here. Doesn't look like it, though. Now. Yeah, I was about to say, I might just be able to wail on him, but I can definitely do this. Oh. Bonk. Goodbye, Ancient Dragon Man. And then he gives us a Dragon Hunter Katana. Yep. Which that thing is gnarly as well. Uh, Yeah, we're good to keep going through here. I think this like takes you directly just to the mountain. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, people pretty much, well, okay, I haven't watched a ton of the bail fight, but what I do know is hitting it in the head is a good idea. I ran past everything, I did not fight a single thing until we got to bail. It was the best thing ever. I do remember the Ash of War on the Dragon Hunter Katana being really good for, for bail. Oh, why, why am I not? Oh, that way. Sorry. Don't mind me. Dude, with the addition of the DLC, there are some areas that I'm like, I don't know how people are going to be able to no hit this. I mean, you know, they'll find a way, but like, seriously, uh, we don't need this. We just want bail. I think this is a, yeah. And dragon smoothing stone. And here we are. Okay. Problem I remember having is actually being able to hit them. Let's go upgrade the ancient. Oh, wait, we're not going to be able to. We're not going to have enough runes. Okay. Now let's go to the summit. Let's try Big Hammer. After Big Hammer, we will try Katana. Oh. There he is. I mean, oh, okay. Uh, too early. I mean, his attacks seem relatively tame. Of course, I say that now. I haven't gotten anything hard yet. 
Okay. So it looks like you would be trying to attack him there. He's going to hit you with the follow-up, Al. Okay, well. Dude, he is a problem to hit. This is exactly what I mean about dragons being hard to hit. Like, how? Oh! Okay. Um, Katana might actually be better. Might. Whoops. Nice. I'm not really sure what's going on sometimes. Nice. That is so cool. That feels like it's out of a movie. Probably have a little bit more time. Okay. Dude, I can't see anything. Okay, yeah, I, I can't see anything. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I mean, super cool fight. Definitely not nearly as hard as Radon, but it, it's definitely cool. It, it's kind of annoying to hit him. Maybe I should stop just trying to go for the head, since it seems that like just poking him with stuff seems to work just fine too. Ow. Okay. See, this is frustrating because he's so cool, but he's so ridiculously hard to hit that it's like, come on. Nice. Oh. Okay. I mean, I, I mean, I just don't really have any thoughts. Like, I think it's cool. It's like, it's super cool, but like at the same time, like, when you have a boss this hard to hit, it's just kind of frustrating. Okay. I mean... Like, I wish that I had, like, some reaction here, but I just don't. <laughs> like, I, I don't feel any sort of way about it. Oh, we can use Lion's Great Claw on this? Okay. Oh. Fireballs. Wait, they- oh. Wait, did they just all explode mid-air? Or did I miss something? I'm hoping we can get a stagger and just end this. No, nope, but we can get yelled at. Dude, I can't I can't see anything, dude. The screen is just red. Bro's got a million and five poise. It got so much poise, man. Nice. <sighs> oh. We're yelling again. How did that hit me? Ow. Oh man, Bail. <sighs> I I don't think I like this fight. There we go, nice. Oh crap, whoops. Well. You, you can't get underneath him, like, ever.
Nice. I don't particularly care for the screaming attack. So let's do it again, why don't we? That was a bad move. Nice. Really? Oh my gosh, okay. Nice. Okay. Bail. Bail. So, uh, first off, it's not a bad fight. I've been getting frustrated for whatever reason. More frustrated than usual with this game. I don't know why. Anyways, take that out of it. Bail is a good fight. It's by... <sighs> Dude, it's so close. Him and Midra are probably my favorite, like, cinematic fights. They're super cool. Phase one is pretty fun. Phase two is a little over the top. The AOEs, the every single move chains into another move and there's no downtime, which it's cool, but it's also annoying because it's like, okay, when are you supposed to attack? Like if we were just doing dodge practice, it would be super cool, but we're not. But we beat Elden Ring. Well, no, we didn't beat Elden Ring. We beat the DLC. Uh, we started in the DLC. Uh, it, it, it frankly, wasn't as hard as nice. It wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Um, getting set up took a while, but after that, it was just about getting enough health to where we don't die by everything and then getting enough skidoo tree fragments. And then, yeah, but anyways, hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to like and subscribe. I appreciate you watching all the way to the end and I will see you on the next one. Peace and blessings.